Hi, Paul and Glenn. G'day. From, from Worm Planet. We're here today to talk to you about our range of fishing worms, fat fishing worms. Um, Glenn, do you think we should tell about how we came upon these worms? Paul, I think that'd be great. Would you um, like to elaborate on uh, how that all came about? Well, it was partly your fault. I know, right? Really? I yeah, full, yeah. full responsibility. Yeah. On our annual Murray Cod fishing trip down the Murray last year, yes. you were responsible for buying the worms, I recall. That was true. What'd you pay for them? Uh, too much. Yep. Around twelve dollars a punnet. Were they any good? No. No. And what did you do? When uh, you... I stamped my feet. Yep. I swore a little bit. Uh, I threw half of them down the ground. Had to pick them up later. What was available mm. when I could find them. And uh, yeah, I was quite disappointed and swore I'd never fish again. But I soon changed my mind. You went on to Google, as I recall. I did. A challenge: find a fat fishing worm. And I did. Which keeps for three months. In the fridge. In the fridge. Tough Reasonable skin. price. Good price. Tough skin. Um, looking into it further, sustain sustainably farmed, they're not stolen from other earth. So you found all those things mm -hmm. in, a, in a worm? In this worm. This worm. Catch your caller. Can I show you a couple? I'd love to see one. I know you've seen something off for a couple of weeks. You get a couple out of a punnet. There's 20 well, in a punnet. They're fat. They are fat. They are That's... fat. Look at that. That's fat. How many in a punnet? 20. 20 in a punnet. Yep. Who do, we, who do we sell them to? Uh, we sell them to all retail outlets in New South Wales. Yep. Service stations, corner stores, bait and fishing shops, IGAs, yep. any, uh, any retailer that, that sells bait fishing products or is a convenience store that offers that sort of service. Yeah. So fantastic products, so versatile, such a long shelf life. Look, they are big. They're not dangerous. No, 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 it's okay. They may curl around your finger a bit and they might fight back when you put them on the hook, right. but they, uh, they are not dangerous. They definitely are a worm. Right, so fat skins... Uh, tough skins. Tough skins? Tough skins. Last in the fridge for three months? Up to three months. Could be longer. Available all year round? Available all year round. Sustainably farmed? Sustainably farmed. Good in fresh and salt water. Important point. Very important. So on the coast, in the estuaries, um, up the Murray, in the lagoons, in the ponds, doesn't matter. They sound like a winner to me, Glenn. Is, that's, they're aptly named the catch-all caller because they do catch all. Yeah. And as you know, went down the Murray River last week to introduce these to some of our existing bait supplies. Yes. Uh, yes. Tackle shops, uh, excellent feedback. Exceptional. Um, and from some of the local fishermen. Yeah. And women. So um, we do have a range of um, signage available for the uh, retailing outlets if they're looking for it. Are they free? They are. Um, we have um, a range of posters, uh, A3, A4 for window fronts, and we do have some core fleet signage um, that we can show. So that's a sample of the... Um, Signage that we do offer in the poster sizes, A3 and A4, which are great, a very basic, simple, clear, concise message. And so we have these awesome core flutes as well for those high traffic areas, for places which uh, may not be initially known as a bait supplier, okay. to draw customers in because they know there's certainly an advantage to be able to offer them their bag of ice and bottle of coke and a bag yeah. of chips. And so if I'm looking to buy these, Glenn, I go to the website? To the website, yes, wormplanet.com.au. Our email's there and um, our ordering facility, or give us a call. All phone numbers are there as well. So, How many do I have to buy? Uh, look, uh, the minimum size box is 18 punnets, which is really nothing in the fishing season. That's, you know, one night's work. Um, up unlimited, but in multiples of 18. Right, so 18, 36, 54? 32 upwards. Okay. So, yeah, great size, very easy to handle. Easy to store. So do I have to keep them in a refrigerated environment? You don't have to, but over the warmer months, it's just advised. So we, the optimum temperature is 15 to 25 degrees. So if you're in, a, in an outlet where it does um, exceed that overnight, we suggest keeping them in the fridge because you'll get such a long shelf life from the product. You pull them out an hour or two, half a day before you go fishing, and they are as active as they are right now. And if I've got some left over at the end of the fishing trip? Put them in the fridge. Excellent. Very easy to look after. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like a winner to me, Glenn. Yeah, that's right. They are, they're a great, great, great worm. So. Yep. Thanks okay. for that, Paul. Good on you. Yeah. Okay, thanks for visiting our website. Good luck with your fishing. Thank you.